Hey guys, and welcome into the Raxi Report. Okay, so I want to do a blabber vlog because I I just I just want to do an unedited talk because I have had a slight epiphany slash um, awakening slash just empowerment. And I want to talk about it, and I want to d discuss how I'm feeling and try and put it into some somewhat of a sentence, <laughs> which is going to be incredibly difficult. First, first things first, I'm sorry if I have ever um, treated you badly or treated you unfairly. If there's anyone out there that I've talked to and I've maybe been a bit vacant with or been a bit passive with, I'm sorry. It's not my intention. And um, I think it was the... This is one of the biggest parts of this is that I, I feel like maybe I've been so lost in my own brain the last two or one, at least at least two years. Um, I've been in a dark place uh, since the start of this year, 2016. I've already discussed um, the guy that I liked, and I've discussed what happened there, and I've discussed how that affected me, and it's made me realise I'm better than that. And it's not just that, it's the idea that I'm on this path of self-destruction, and I'm on this path of putting myself down because of other people. I'm me. I, I'm my own person. And I need to stand up for what's right. And I need to do something with my life. Because I, otherwise I'm just sat here. I'm on this endless loop. This endless circle of just nothingness. And that's basically what my life is right now. I can't thank my family enough for taking me back in after I lost the place I had in Trowbridge in 2012. But you know what? I don't like being here. Because I feel like I'm stuck in this, this, this kind of rut where I can't really move on and... Um, sorry, my hair keeps getting in my mouth. Um, and... I, 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 I need to... I need to do something and anxiety and depression is so harmful and it's so degrading and it's so it's just it's like someone's grabbing me by the throat it's like someone's holding me back all the time okay and it's hard it's really really hard and I so many people suffer with anxiety and depression and a multitude of mental health issues and it's something that we need to talk about because it's something that's so harmful. It's so harmful. And you get lost. You get so lost in it. Today, I'm turning over a new leaf. I'm turning over a new leaf. I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna do something with my life, and and you know what I really, really want to do? I really want to be an activist or someone who's trying to do something for better and for good. And you guys have shown me so much support and so much care and and love that I, I couldn't ask for a better community and and you know what I will be recording my gender clinic meeting and it's going to involve personal stuff and I don't care because I want you guys to see firstly where the issues lie in the gender clinic but I also want you to see the process because no one gets an insight into the process of transitioning through a gender clinic because it's just not talked about and this is something that I really want to get out there and want people to be able to know before going and I will be recording even if it's just audio I don't care I want to get I want to get footage or some form of 
some form of evidence out there. Because I think that right now, we're on the front lines of this whole LGBT thing, and we need to push forwards and we need to fight back. So that's, that's what I want to do. That's two weeks away. It may be sad, it may be horrible, but you know what? I, I don't care. I'm fighting for what I believe in. Um, I'd, I love, I love all of you. And, and I wouldn't be here if it wasn't for the amazing support you guys give because, uh, you just, you just so nice. <laughs> um, I, uh, I, I just, I, I've emotionally blurted all over your faces and I'm sorry. I'm sorry about that. I, um, I just had an emotional moment then. Okay. Just, just back, back it down. <laughs> we need to do something about it and I need to move my life on I don't want to get stuck on stupid decisions anymore because my life has been full filled with stupid decisions if you're watching this the guy that I liked all those years ago just know that I've moved on, and I'm a hell of a lot better than you are. And that goes for anyone that's put me down. Because you know what? I'm standing up for what I want, and I'm standing up for what I believe in, and I'm doing something with my life. From this point forward. I love you all, and... Uh, I just want to get this out there because I'm, 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 I'm feeling it right now and I just want to blabber into your face. Don't let anxiety and depression get you down. Don't. Stand up to it. Fight back. I love you. Thanks for watching, but until next time, that's me. Out. Bye, guys.